yeah, we going at it today. Let me let me be honest, y'all. I got my boy out here with his MPX. I'm a fan of the MPX, so I'm not here to diss it or anything. But we got it out here with the Stripe Bog as well. We're going to go some distance. I don't know if y'all can see down here. I don't know if I can zoom in. It's a can on top of that steel in between those poles. And I think we're about what? What, what would you say? It's about 40 yards. Maybe. About 40 yards. Um... He got one shot to hit that can. We're going to do what? one, and then you do one. No problem. Uh, and I haven't shot at all yet, y'all. Let me remind you, Daryl Beaton took about 1,700 shots already. And he misses. Well, I'll let you shoot till you hit it. Go ahead. A little high. No. It's all right. We good. We good. Got a slight jam with the MPX. We ain't gonna put that on YouTube. All right, he on shot four. Finally, six shots it took him. Five. Five. Five? Yeah. Oh, they yeah, just cheated me. You know what? Forward. It's all on camera. What you, little Daryl B. Jr. Uh, he yeah. said took Daryl B. I say like eleven shots. Five. He say five. Five. I got the can. If you want to pan down there to the can. Mind y'all, I'm still cold. I'm fat. I'm hungry. I ain't oh, ate nothing. Got all excuses. But I'm coming out. One shot, strike by, because I say this is best nine millimeter carbine now. Mm. I got a hollow sun on here. What kind of what kind of uh a good one? What kind That's you got good. on there? Oh, I got a six, a Romeo five, Max. He got he got a he got a that's the, the optic that's on there? Uh -huh. Yeah, Romeo 5 Max on there, so. Let's see what we're working with. I got one shot to get him. One shot. And we out of here. We from Chicago. Problem with us is, we don't like to lose. Too competitive. I told him, he didn't hit it. He took him, they say five. I said it took him 11 to hit it the first time. We back again, 40 yards out. First time I had sweat in my eye. Okay. Because it's hot. Sig and PX. Yeah. Romeo Max sight on it. He got one shot to hit the can. This is our second go around. Study long, you study wrong. I tried to tell him. It took him two shots that time. All right, so look. It took Daryl B with the C $5,000 MPX. Five shots to hit that can. I came in and showed him. My first shot of the day, hit the can. He told me it was a fluke, so we about to do it again. I'm yeah, about 40 home. yards out. He said he had sweat in his eyes, all type yeah. stuff. Yeah, home court advantage the first time. Okay, whatever. How are we going to do first it? First time, yeah. This hit again, 40 yards out. Grand Power Stripe Box, SP983. Best 9mm carbine on the market. I keep trying to tell everybody I want to listen. Don't shake, man. You good, bro. I'm telling you, I'm comfortable. No shaking. No shaking. <laughs> All right, listen. This is what I do. I keep telling him this thing. This thing. He going to go buy one because he's a gun snob. So probably Monday he's going to be like, bro, I got the strike box. No, I'm trying good, to tell you. It's a good gun. Bro. It is what it is. It's a good gun. It's a good gun. But That's I what we know, y'all. Thank you, brother. So look, he going to make me shoot the MPX just so he can tell me to say, that the MPX is better than the Stripe Bob. They're not gonna say that. First of all, the MPX is kinda hot already. They done ran some shots to it. Secondly, you go touch the Stripe Bob, I ain't ran as many shots, but it don't get hot like that. Okay. I ain't gonna lie. It ain't this... got no foregrip on it like yours, though. Oh, yeah. See. I don't know enough, y'all. <laughs> but I wanna shoot it, though, just to see the difference. Do I gotta press the button or something? Oh, there it go, there it go, there it go. Damn, I just had it. I lost it. See, I can't get it. It ain't got nothing. It's, it's the Cubs hat. It's the Cubs. Put it it's on. It's the hat, man. Let me see it ain't that. the girl. Socks, socks versus Cubs tonight. It's the right, Cubs hat. I'm here good. we go.
It's nice. <laughs> Keep going. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> yeah, it's smooth. So look, shout out my boy Diesel TV because he said that the MPX had much lighter recoil. It does. That's a fact. It does. Um, the trigger on this is definitely a little lighter than the trigger on the stripe box. I give it that too. However, hey, how do I uh, release the boat? Put the button on the side. Did you charge it back? Yes, I already charged it. Yep. You can this one? Yeah, it's ambidextrous. Yeah. Oh, okay. Perfect. I like that too. That's sweet. Ambidextrous. So is the stripe bar, guys. <laughs> I can't say the word, but it got stuff on both sides too. Let's go. Do I prefer the stride bot? Yes, not because it's better. I mean, that's, that'll be, that's, subje that's uh, su subjective. What's the? subjective. That's the word I was looking for. But I like the stride bot because it feels more comfortable in my hand. By me being a big dude, there'll be a big dude too, so I'm surprised the stride bot don't feel more comfortable to him. But this thing is definitely more, it's better if I was really trying to backpack it, carry it, it has all the intangibles in terms of that, like just being small or lighter, little to no recoil, pretty accurate. So I like the MPX too, but I'm still team stripe bog, y'all. Yeah.